Hey guys, it's Alicia. I have got a Kroger haul here. I went and did my two week shop like I typically do for Weight Watcher meals for the next two weeks, which usually ends up being six meals, three a week between leftovers and cheat day. Um, three dinners usually does it for us. So that's what I went and shopped for. Plus I also shopped for Christmas dinner. It is the 19th today. So coming in on Christmas pretty quick. So I shopped for that as well. So I will jump in and show you what I got. And I'll also try to mention the meals that I'm going to be making, but I will show them at the end. Got a couple pineapples, got two bunches of bananas, got some bell peppers. I got these for, well, at least one of them for some Mexican quinoa I'm going to be doing. And then the rest I'll probably just chop up and eat. Got some potatoes. I'm going to be doing a cheeseburger soup. That's a new recipe for me. So I need that for that. And I can't remember if I need those for something else, but got a couple bags of these halos. These have been really, really good. This is the time of year to buy these. I think just been eating a ton of those. Got two bunches of green onions, not specifically for anything I don't think. Oh wait, yes. At least one of these will be going in egg roll in a bowl. And then I just like having green onions. Got a white onion. This is for my pea salad, my holiday pea salad I make pretty much every Christmas. So got that for that. And then back here I got some coleslaw for my egg roll in a bowl. I got this one that's reduced. And that is how many ounces? 11.4 ounces. And then I got a 16 ounce one, two. So both of those will be going into my egg roll in a bowl. Back here, they had their coffee made on a little bit of sale. So I picked up two of them. Zero sugar. This is my favorite. Still is Italian sweet cream. And then got a coconut cream. Got a bag of ruffles. We are going to be going camping again after Christmas. So that's for that. And so are these. Um, we have a Keurig in our trailer or travel trailer, travel trailer. I can't talk today. And um, we don't really use the K-Cups inside that much anymore or inside in the house. We've got our Hamilton Beach over there that we are brewing carafes of coffee with. So we haven't been doing a lot of K-Cups and the K-Cups we have left in here. I'm not a fan of. So I got these to take camping. I got a Kroger donut shop. I haven't tried their donut shop before. That was on sale. And then I really like the Green Mountain French Vanilla, which is funny because I'm not a big French Vanilla fan as far as flavors go, especially in something like Coffee Mate. But I really like their French Vanilla Coffee. So got that. That was on sale too. Got some Cosmic Crisp Apples. Those were on sale. I think they're 99 cents a pound, which is a really good price for Cosmic Crisp. Those are my favorite apple. A little bit sweet, a little bit tart, very crisp texture, just like the name. And got four large avocados. Got a bag of petite carrots. I believe this is for the cheeseburger soup. Got some romaine hearts. This is going to be for my pea salad, my holiday pea salad as well. And then here, got a bag of cranberries. I'm gonna be making some cranberry bread. I have a recipe for that. I have a recipe for the a recipe video for the uh, salad too. It's not Weight Watcher friendly. Um, this bread is, but I'm gonna link or have links for every recipe down in the description box if it's something I have a video on. So I'm gonna be doing cranberry bread for Christmas. Here, I've got three pounds of bacon. This was on sale, the Oscar Mayer. Uh, one of these will be for my salad and then one of these will be camping or for camping and then the other one I'll just throw in my freezer. Bacon is so expensive. I like to get it when it is on sale. So three of those. Got some Hellman's light mayo. I've been using a lot of light mayo lately in dips and different things. I'm gonna probably be doing more crab salad for lunches up this week. So got that for that too. And then I got some Lighthouse Chunky Blue Cheese dressing. This is for my pea salad. And so is this Swiss cheese. Back there, I got some butter. I got a couple pounds that was on sale. I got some all purpose flour. 
I'm gonna be doing holiday rolls and I think I'm running a little low on just my regular all-purpose flour. So I got that. Picked up some of this 2% Velveeta, that's for the cheeseburger soup. Can of corn, that's for the Mexican quinoa. Can of sweet peas for the pea salad and a can of petite diced tomatoes for the Mexican quinoa. And then got some crab. I mentioned I'm probably gonna be doing, either this week or next week, more of the crab salad for lunches. I love that stuff. I, I have shown that in a video that I'll link down below as well. This is what we're gonna be having for Christmas. Spiral sliced brown sugar ham. So we're gonna be having that salad and rolls and I think that's pretty much it. We're gonna keep it really simple this year. Got some Hormel turkey pepperoni. That is for monkey bread pizza. Got some ice cream for my son, just artesian, artesian vanilla bean. Then also for my son, I'm gonna be doing Christmas cookies here in the next couple days or so. So I needed some powdered sugar for the frosting for those. And got some garlic, cause I was running low. Got my son some more Nutella and picked up a ranch dip mix. One of my viewers requested a dip, so I'm gonna to try to make that in the next couple weeks or soon anyway, so I got that for that. And then back here I got some orange juice. This is for my cranberry bread and then I will take, or we will take the rest of that camping. Um, that's for camping, Canada Dry. I love this cranberry ginger ale. It's really good if you haven't tried it and you like ginger ale and cranberry. And then for camping or whenever, picked up some of this Bold Rock hard cider blackberry. And then these, we tried these recently, the hard Mountain Dew. These are really, really good. If you like Mountain Dew, the problem is they don't really taste a whole lot like alcohol. So you could get in trouble with them because I think they're 5%, yeah, 5%, but they, don't you think they just kind of taste like the soda? Pretty close. Yeah, they, they pretty much taste like the soda. Now they are, there's four different flavors and I'll put the points up for these as well as everything else that has points. There is Baja Blast, watermelon, and then I think that's just regular and black cherry. So picked up that and then here got some frozen broccoli florets. That is for a broccoli soup I'm gonna be doing, one of these bags at least, and then the other I'll probably just have for a side if I don't throw it in the soup too. Got a couple more of these lilies. Um, have I got you the hazelnut before? I can't remember. I can't remember if we've got this one before or not. Anyway, got a hazelnut, and then I know we definitely have not tried the uh, cookies and cream. So I got those two to try. And then here I got 60 count eggs. I always get sticker shock whenever I see the price of eggs. I think that was like 20, 21 dollars for 60 eggs, so it's crazy. And then finally, I have never seen the 12 pack Zero Sugar Root Beer, Big K, their brand, at my store before. They're, there's always a sticker, but it's always out, and then the uh, two liter bottles are pretty much always out, but occasionally I can find those, but I've never seen these before. They actually had them today, so I picked two of those up. This stuff is really good if you like, um, don't you think it's kind of similar to the A&W? Or not, but it's really good for a store brand root beer. I don't know, it's really good. So picked up that, and I think that was everything. So my total was 230.76 and I saved 57.37. And then I'll show you what is on the meal plan for the next two weeks. Like I think I mentioned, yeah, I did. A roll in a bowl, broccoli soup, cheeseburger soup, monkey bread pizza, and Mexican quinoa. And then of course we're gonna have Christmas dinner, which is gonna last at least two or three days, I would guess. So that is what I'm gonna be making in the next couple of weeks. I have got videos on everything but the cheeseburger soup. So 
I'll go ahead and link all those down in the description box. I typically do what's for dinners on my meals, but I don't think I'm going to be doing them on, on this next couple of weeks just because it is Christmas break. My kiddo's home, we've got a bunch of different stuff planned, so not probably gonna have time to film those. Plus I wanna take a little bit of a uh, YouTube break. So I think what I will do is maybe film the cheeseburger soup since I haven't shown that before. I might just do a designated video for that or show it in something like uh, what I eat in a day. Let me know if you wanna see that and I will try to get that filmed in one way or another. But like I said, I think I'm gonna go ahead and just take the next couple weeks off as far as filming the what's for dinners. I've got designated videos for everything else anyway, I'm pretty sure, so. That is what we've got going for the next couple weeks. Let me know what you guys are doing for Christmas dinner down in the comments below, I'm curious. Like I said, we're just kind of keeping ours pretty simple this year. It's just the three of us, so I'm not gonna do a whole lot. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you have a very Merry Christmas, and I will see you on the next one.